New Hampshire police are looking for someone who killed a beloved family pet. The dog disappeared two nights ago and was shot to death in the woods just yesterday. As Julie Lonchek explains, the owners now are trying to figure out who would do such a thing. He may have weighed 115 pounds, but for the Carter family, Titan was still their puppy. He was a family member. He was, he was, he had a great personality. He was the best dog anyone can ask for. Early Wednesday morning, Brandon says his mother let their Bernese Mountain Dog outside, something she had done almost every day during the first year of his life. He stays in the area and he'll always come back within like the hour. Except this time. It was terrible. 12 hours after Titan went missing, Brandon found him, less than 300 yards from their Auburn, New Hampshire home. I was just hoping that he was, he was sleeping when I was walking up toward him and then once I actually got closer and felt him, I realized he was frozen solid. One shot to the head, shell casings found nearby. Deer hunting season had just started here, but Titan certainly didn't look like a deer. And this, well, this is private property. Police believe a hunter is likely responsible. Brandon Carter believes that hunter should take responsibility. I don't know who could do something like that and leave the dog out there in the woods. It's just kind of a heartless act. In Auburn, New Hampshire, Julie Lonchek, WBZ News.